Hello, people of YouTube. This is Mega Man Sonic X. Or, if you're watching this from my form, not a member of, then you'll be Alpha Omega of Trez. Anyways, today I'm going to be showing you how to use this little program called VGM Trance. It's basically a Nintendo DS Ripper. It's still in its pre alpha phase, so it isn't entirely the best yet. Anyways, let's open it up. My computer will ever load it. There we go. So, this is basically it. So, here's what you're gonna do you are gonna need to take a ROM that you would like to rip music from. For instance, I did the Sonic Rush E3, but now I'm gonna show with another one. Okay, so I have my Bakde DS ROM here. And all you're going to do is take it, drag it in. That simple. And it might take some time to load depending on how big it is, as you could have seen. Now, these are all the tidbits that make up the song. And then, down here at the bottom, are going to be all of the songs that appear in the game. And here's even a little listen. Well, first you're going to need to click it, then click play. Okay, so as you can see, it's working fine. However, there is a slight problem. You can export the songs, though you can't do it from down here, you're going to need to go over here and find the files that begin SEQ or have this little musical symbol. You can export them, but it is, but they do get converted to a MIDI. So that's sort of a negative. And also there are some wave samples. And I'm not sure what this is. Probably probably voice clips but then you could sit, export all of them as WAV files but there are some ups and downs to this this is pre-alpha so you might have some crashing problems and not a lot of functionality let's open it up again and also as some of you might know some of the newer ROMs that come out past 06 I think it's 06 have more security, so it won't be compatible, unfortunately, with everything. Not yet, at least. Example, here is Sonic Classic Collection, which just came out uh, March 1st, 2010. As you can see, unlike Bakked ATS, which took some time to load, this isn't doing it at all. So there are some cons, but not... But... Not much I could help with that. However, with other ROMs, it will work just fine. Let's open this up. It's like here's. I should have adjusted the screen before I started filming. So, like here is Mega Man Battle Network 5 Double Team DS. Fortunately, as you could see, everything was ripped fine. Got your BGMs down here. You can press play if you want to play it. So it's working great. Boss music. So that's basically it. That's all I can show you right now. There's nothing more. Oh, and if you look at here, yeah, if any of you bother to even look at the README, these don't work yet, so. But what you can do is right-click close and if you want to drag another ROM in. And that's basically all I have to say for this tutorial. And hopefully as more releases come out later in the future, when you continues to work on this, they will be improved. But in the meantime, that's all we have right now. And I say, hey...
this is better than nothing after all. I mean, at least now we can actually attempt to rip stuff that isn't available yet. Well, anyways, that's all I have to show you. So, yeah.